Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name, of course, is Derek, and I'd like to uh, show you something pretty awesome. Something I've been really, really hyped for for a while. Now, every console generation that comes out, I always get the newest console, usually the day of uh, launch. And today I was lucky enough, which I've had it pre ordered for a while, to get this beauty. And they figured, you know, let's open it up and see what's all in here. And um, that way you guys know, you know, what you're getting yourself into whenever you get the system yourself. Now, keep it on me f on Thursday, I believe. We'll be opening up the PlayStation 5 Visual Edition. So I'm pretty excited about that. The only thing I, I, I don't have right now, I don't have many games f for it, except for my old backwards uh, compat titles. So... I'm hoping to remedy that hopefully soon. If we can get this thing open, <laughs> it doesn't want to open. I gotta be really careful. Now, this thing is heavy. I'm not gonna lie, this thing weighs a ton. So, I don't. Here we go. <sighs> this is so bad. This just doesn't open on me. Oh, that's probably why I, I have more tape on it. <laughs> Worst unboxing video ever, ever. Nah, but for real, guys. Um, excited about this, and let's start getting things. Okay. So first things first. Let's start grabbing the small thing before we move to the big thing. All right. So you get this small little box. You get your HDMI cable. Your power cord. You get your instruction booklet, just in case you don't know how to operate a console in 2020. And we get this baby. I've heard the Xbox Series X controller is not much different than the original, but it has some quality of life things for it, especially like the backside, the grips feel good. It kind of feels like the Elite controller, um, but it's not a whole lot different. Actually, let's let's take a look. I, I'll compare um, a couple. I'll compare the Elite controller with this controller. Just that way you can kind of see. So here's the Elite controller, and it's got these uh, rubber rise grips. Now this controller, very similar, very similar in design. There's not much of a difference there, uh, but on this you have the circular D-pad. And uh, it still takes batteries, but you can buy a rechargeable kit. Um, I always do every time I get a new controllers. Um, I always buy the uh, play and charge kicks because they're really, really handy. And plus, I do not like buying batteries every time a new console comes out. So let's dig a little bit deeper. This little thing was wrapping the consoles. How are your dreams? Be nice, be nice if I was able to get a couple titles. Um, which, oh man, this thing is heavy. Okay, this is a wrap. It's a, this thing weighs a lot. I'm not kidding when I say that. It literally weighs a lot. All right, let's try to get it open. And how do you feel? Like, it's like a, the stand that it's on is rubber. It seems like. Okay, there it is. And that's all its beauty. Let's take a look at the back. Okay, that's awesome. And here's the top of the system and the bottom. So probably this will be like uh, set it up like a tower, a PC tower. So whenever I set this up later, uh, I'll have this set up in... I can kind of tell you how things are, are whenever we finally get it up. Let's check see if there's anything else in the box. Nope. That's it. Now that, that's all that was in the box. So yeah. Um let me go ahead and get this thing plugged up and later today I'll have a video showing the UI and everything. 
But guys, thank you so much for stopping by to view this unboxing. Um, it's I've never done a console unboxing before, and I don't really have enough room to do so, but I wanted to try my best to get one out. Um, if you haven't already, feel free to hit the follow button, hit that subscribe button. I uh, definitely like to earn your follows and subscriptions. Uh, and of course, you don't have to. If you want to, that would be amazing. Um, stay tuned for Thursday. We'll have the PlayStation 5 Digital Edition ready to be opened. So, we'll get it. again, we don't have any games to test out on it because stuff. But anyways, it'll be fine. I'll be able to test out some of the uh, backwards compatible titles. But other than that, guys, thank you so much for stopping by, and I hope that if you get a chance to get one of these systems, let me know what you guys think. Um, I, again, it, to me, it looks like it's going to be a good deal. So, But other than that, guys, take it easy.